Hello, thank you for tuning into my channel. And we're doing an October monthly plan with me. This is super sped up. I mean, super <laughs> sped up. I am using one of my favorite books, which is the Carpe Diem Seasons book. It's perfect for monthly. It's just enough stickers to fill out a monthly page. The stickers are not too big. There's also a mini version of this, so the stickers are even smaller. So if you have a personal planner, that works as well. And what I'm doing right now is I'm just kind of layering these stickers on here. Can we believe it's already October? Where Where is the year going? Before we know it, I'll be doing a December monthly spread. And so right now I'm just putting stickers sporadically. When it comes to my monthly spreads, hell, even my weekly spreads, I don't really have a plan going into it. I'm just like, it needs to be functional and I need to be able to write. <laughs> so I'm kind of placing stickers down just sporadically all over the place. And I place stickers where I can still write in the boxes, except for Halloween. I kind of messed that up there, but it's quite okay. We're not really doing much on Halloween except for going trick-or-treating. So doesn't really, doesn't really matter much what I'm doing on that day. Um, we know we're going trick-or-treating. So I like putting that witch hat right there on the 6th. And I am just putting things, these little, they're, they're like little headers a little bit, but they have little arrows on them. I like putting those on days where I know things will be happening, such as Mondays, Wednesdays, and the weekend. So I am just finishing this up here. This didn't take me long to decorate. I wanted you to know it was Halloween without it screaming, this is Halloween um, sort of thing. So I kind of zoomed out a little bit so you guys can see. I love that little moon sticker up there that I put right next to the O for October. Really cute. And I put a small pumpkin right up there next to that bigger pumpkin. And I was kind of irritated because I'm like, I just put a pumpkin sticker right there on Sunday and there's one up here. So I felt like there's a lot of pumpkins all over the place. I wanted to even out these stickers. So I put some bats up there on the top left. I mean, top right. And I love this candy corn sticker, even though I do not like candy corn at all. I detest that candy. It tastes absolutely disgusting to me. But yeah, I'm putting some of these little bitty checklists right here. That way, if I need to write things down, I have a checklist. And yeah, so we are going to get on to the writing portion of this. Hello, and we're back with all the pen written in. I think I'm going to start doing my plan with me's like this. Like put the stickers down and then come up with the pen and let you know what's all written in, whether it be for a monthly or a weekly. You let me know what you guys think. I think that makes the most sense with things written in. That way you can see how it's going to go instead of writing because that tends to take a little while. So anyway, um, everything is written in. Um, October is not a really busy month. There are, um, there's no holidays or anything like that. I do have work and personal in here. And as you can see, I still have room to write things down if necessary. So let's get started with this side over here. I'm going to zoom in. Okay. So everything that is home personal related is written at the top and anything that is, um, work related is down at the bottom. So I have PR and I have videos that I'm going to do. So I'm going to basically tell you guys what is all coming for the month of October. Um, as far as home and personal stuff goes, I know my daughter is going to have an ortho appointment at the end of the month. I'm not sure of the date and she doesn't go until after we come back from out of town. I'm trying to get this video filmed. So that'll be filmed in. That'll be filled in when um, after her appointment and after this video is already up. And I do have marked down all the days that my daughters get out early. My daughter gets out, my oldest gets out early every single Monday and my youngest gets out early every single Wednesday. And I know that I do, I am actually going to write with my Coletto pen because that is a 0 0.3, I believe. Yes. So I'm going to put... Haley grade check. I check Haley's grades every Wednesday. That way if something is missing or something, she has time to turn in before the week is over. So that'll be written down every single week. And like I say in my, in my, in my, in my, in my, <laughs> like I said in my thought process, my monthly spread is like the catalyst that starts it all. It is what I look at before I plan my weeks. So if it's not written on the monthly, chances are it's not going to get written on the weekly. And these are things that I know that are going to happen. Um, I'm usually I'm now I'm like a plan as you go. So I only write down the things that were not 
that I don't know that are coming up, I write them down as the day gets here. So I know that the blue can is going to be emptied, you know, on the 9th and it's going to be emptied on the 23rd. I know those days are coming, so that is written in. But I do have, you know, spaces in case any appointments come up, in case something pops up that I don't know about, whatever. And so I'm basically going to tell you guys what is coming up for the month of October as far as work goes. And like I said, the only appointment I have that I know of so far is my daughter's ortho appointment. I know she, I think there's a dermatologist appointment in here somewhere. I'm not exactly sure. I'm going to have to call and verify because I don't even have it in my phone. Um, so anyways, um, the first week of October, you guys are going to see the Transcendence Planner Review. I already did an unboxing of this. And you're going to see the Path Planner Review. That's the first week of October. The second week of October, you guys are going to see my Planner Must Haves. And there's going to be a chatty get ready with me video. The third week of October, which is the week of the 15th, you are going to see my Erin Condren dashboard review. And you're going to see a Wild Fable review. Wild Fable are two bags I got from Target. Wild Fable is a line. And since I got them around the same time, I wanted to review those bags. The third week of October, which is the week of the 22nd, you're going to see my winter skincare routine. And you're going to see a November plan with me. Um... And then the week of the 29th, you're going to see a Halloween plan with me. Hilarious story about that. Um, I decorated the wrong year. <laughs> I decorated the wrong year. But Gracie, who is um, from Odoodle Shop, who's the owner, said she would send me another kit. It's a really pretty kit. It turned out really, really cute. Only thing I know of how this happened is because... All I can do is laugh. <laughs> I just happened to open it to October. I even filmed a video on this. It's a good 15 minute long video. And I not once did I notice that this set 2019 the entire time. I got to laugh at myself, but I will be filming with the same kit and October plan with me <laughs> video. Um, and so that's the week of the, um, that the 31st will be up. It's the week of the 29th that 30 Halloween is on a Wednesday. And so you'll see a plan with me that Saturday before. Um, so, yeah. Oh, and then that Tuesday, the 30th, you guys will see a health update. Um, for as far as the first goes, I don't know what's going to go up because I haven't planned November yet. So that is what is going on for the month of October as far as work goes. And as you guys can see, even though I have personal and work going on, I still have a ton of room to write, even though there's stickers going on in here. So just to let you know, I always say this, you can have function with decor as long as you plan it right. So yeah, I am going to get out of here. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and do that. And I will see you all next time. Bye.